Once you've completed processing payroll and printed off your paychecks, now you're ready to pay your payroll liabilities. To do so, go to Employees from the main menu at the top and then select Pay Payroll Liabilities. Your show liabilities through date is very important as this is the date that actually affects your liability balances and when those balances are relieved. Typically, your show liabilities through date should be the paycheck date. Your payment date is the actual check date that you are paying the payroll liabilities. If you have monthly liabilities that you're paying, then select the last day for the month of, for the period that you are paying the liabilities for. Select the bank account that you're making the payment from. Now you're ready to select the actual payroll items that you need to pay. The amount due, based off of the show liabilities through date, will automatically populate to the right. If the payable to vendor is the same on multiple items that you're paying at once, these will all be included on one check. Once you have verified the information on your payroll liabilities and the amounts to pay, you're ready to create the check. Click the Create Checks button, and now your check has been created. To review the check or to print the check, go to Banking, Checklist, look up the Pay To, the check date, or type in the check number to print. Payroll liability payments will be indicated as such when viewing the check. You will see the tab that says payroll liabilities and the total amount of payroll liabilities paid. You can add a memo or if you make these payments online, simply uncheck the to be printed checkbox and enter in a confirmation number or ACH to indicate that this was a payment made online rather than printing off a check and mailing a check to the vendor. For more information on paying payroll liabilities, click F1 to read the help topic on payroll liabilities.